Um, no. Courtney and I are examining our options with regard to intimacy. Hold up. You haven't hit that yet? What? Well, women don't talk like that. Well, I do. Girl, you are all right with me. <laughs> I can hang with the big dogs. Mm -hmm. So, JT, why are you punking out? <laughs> I'm not punking out. All right, I'm, uh, I'm pacing myself. But tonight's the night. That's my boy. Who likes to look fly? Can pick up any guy with a slick rap line. Nice. Give him the eye, get the keys to the ride, and live the single life. Little teasing on the side. She's the type of chick who like to wear fly clothes. It rocks the let toes, but we'll get get told. If anybody knows, I'ma tell you who knows. Who will spin the cash flow? Let the story be told. Come on. EVE. How you do that? 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 This calamari is amazing, but it is so bad for you. All that grease and cholesterol, heart attack waiting to happen. You want one? Two, please. <laughs> hey, that guy over there has been staring at us since we got here. I know. If he were ugly, it'd be rude. <laughs> I think he's coming over. Well, who can blame him? So much fabulousness at one table, it must be making him crazy. <sighs> Our beauty is our burden. <laughs> Your table seems much more fun than mine. That's because it is. Um, I'm Shelly, and this is my friend Rita. I'm Joe. And I gotta tell you, it is so refreshing to see two beautiful women uh, actually eating. <laughs> Please, we're not beautiful. We're just two average, ordinary women who wear very little makeup. <laughs> so, Joe, join us. <clears throat> Tell us about yourself. How's your wife, your kids, your gay lover? <laughs> <laughs> Answer the question. I'm single, no kids, and happily hetero. I also own my own construction business. Buildings? Yachts. Really? <laughs> yes, I design and build my own by hand. I'd love to take you out on it. Are you busy Sunday? I'm available. Me too. Great. Um, here's my number. And don't forget your bathing suits. We shouldn't be allowed to walk the streets. No man is safe. <laughs> What's so funny? Is my skirt tucked into my panties again? Girl, no. We were laughing about this cute guy we just met. Janie, oh. you should have seen him. He has this way of looking you in the eyes and making you feel like he has a yacht. <laughs> Rita, you are so shallow. Did she mention he had a yacht? <laughs> I can't wait till Sunday. Well, what's Sunday? I know it's not church. <sighs> Joe invited us yachting. <laughs> and I'm gonna wear my red Brazilian bikini. Oh, shoot. I just remembered I won't be able to go. I'll have to take a rain check. Why? Well, my grandmother's gonna be in town for the day and I promised to go see her. Mm. Oh, Rita, that's too bad. Are you sure you can't get out of... No. I love my grandmother. Okay, she's rich, I'm broke, you do the math. Mm. Here you go. You're not trying to get me drunk, are you? No. If I were, I'd bust out the bourbon. <laughs> <laughs> no, really, I got some if you want it. Wine is fine. We've been talking all night. You know, my, my tongue hurts. <laughs> you can kiss it and make it better. <laughs> JT, I'm, I'm just not ready. Okay. Um, Courtney, we've been seeing each other for a while, and... What's up? <laughs> Look, I really like you. I'm just not interested in having sex with you. I'm not interested in having sex with anyone. I'm celibate. Oh. Oh? Yeah, I was thinking a whole lot more. Just, oh, is all that came out. <laughs> so, um, 
celibate. <laughs> yes, I am not gonna sleep with anyone until I find that one special guy. Well, when you find him, can you and I sleep together? <laughs> so is this gonna be a problem? <laughs> Please. You know, sex isn't even that important to me. Really? Nah, I'm lying. <laughs> but, you know, I like you. And, uh, I'm willing to give it a try. You know, JT, there are still things we can do. Really? Yeah. Come here. <laughs> oh. Call you tomorrow. <laughs> Surprised to see you here. I thought you and Courtney had plans. Turns out she had other plans. Courtney is celibate. Uh-oh. Celibate is code for feed me and take me home, cornball. <laughs> you know, I happen to like Courtney. Besides, you know, I don't want to be that guy who won't date a girl just because she won't have sex with me. But you are that guy. Well, yeah, but I don't want people to know it. <laughs> JT, if you like this girl, then you should stick with the relationship. You know, celibacy really isn't that difficult to deal with. How do you know? Okay, I, I'm gonna be honest with you, and I do not expect to be mocked. Well, then I'm gonna have to leave the room. I have, from time to time, purely as an intellectual exercise, <clears throat> abstained from sex. I was once celibate for eight months. How many more days before it's nine months? Anyway, JT, I'm serious. I think you should give this celibacy thing a try. You're about to take your first step into a whole new world. Yeah, frustration world. Where nobody rides anything. Good morning, lady. Hmm, somebody's in a good mood. Oh, my date with Joe yesterday was off the hook. Joe? You better be talking about Joe Piscopo. <laughs> Girl, nobody's talking about Joe Piscopo. <laughs> Wait. Shelly, you went out with our Joe? He was my Joe yesterday. He took me out on his yacht. We picnicked on an island. I never knew how much I liked papaya. <laughs> I can't believe you. You went out with Joe behind my back? You papaya-sucking backstabber. <laughs> I didn't stab you in the back. He invited us both. You couldn't go. Yeah, but I took a rain check. If I take a rain check, you have to take one too. It wasn't raining where I was. <laughs> you know what? That's crap. What you did was shady. Um, you could have been on that yacht if you weren't so busy shaking down Granny. But he asked us what you both. expect me no, not to go. Okay, no, that's enough. enough. That's enough. Now, Rita, you couldn't go out on the boat. <sighs> Shelly could. Live with it. Yeah, live with it. <laughs> And Shelly, Rita's your friend. You should be more sensitive to her feelings. I am getting no sensitivity. <laughs> now, it's settled. Y'all hug. I'm not hugging her. <laughs> ow, ow, ow! <laughs> there, isn't that better? We're all friends. Bitch. <laughs> How's celibacy going, Fabi Flanagan? It's great. You know, my energy is totally refocused. I got up early, worked out, balanced my checkbook, and now I'm cataloging my CDs. What next? I'm gonna plow the field so we can plant some pole beans? <laughs> <laughs> but I'm telling you, man, I, I never realized what a distraction sex is. See? I told you. When I was celibate, I climbed the Himalayas to meet the Dalai Lama. You met the Dalai Lama? No, 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 he wasn't home. I probably should have phoned first. She likes to party every Thursday. I noticed that you and Rita seem to get along better today. I love Rita. She just needs to realize she can't have everything she wants. Especially if it's what you want. Exactly. <laughs> Look, Rita will be fine. She'll bounce back from this in no time. Ooh, look who just bounced in.